on, Tim. Hurry up. Be there in a minute. He's just a bit awkward, you know. I mean, I've, I've nothing in common with him, you know. He, he thought Dr. Pepper was a real guy. It just takes him a while to warm up to people. I am ready to rock. Are, are you not getting changed, Tim? Duh. It's, it's, it's going to be pretty cold up there, you know, so... Are you not aware that heat rises, Mark? As we go up, we're getting closer to the sun. It's obviously going to get warmer. Tim, it might be a good idea to put on something warmer. Mark has some spare clothes you can borrow. Yeah, sure. So long as I don't end up looking like something from Brookback Mountain. <laughs> well, lucky for you, Tim, I've left my gay cowboy outfit at home, so you'll be fine. There's nothing gay about being a cowboy, Mark. You, you've seen Brookback Mountain, right? I mean, it, it was pretty gay. Yeah. No. Right, I'm going to let the wardens know we are going up, and you two better stop back here when I get back. Whoa, <laughs> there you are, oh, my personal space. Do I look stupid, Mark? <laughs> I, do, I mean, I, do, do you really want me to answer? No, I, of, of course I, I don't think you're stupid, Tim. I spent five years on my own in the outback. I think I know a little bit more about wilderness survival than you do. Why, well, I, I, I just missed the bit in the survival handbook where it says that, you know, sandals are, are a must. Okay. 